Yeah, I mean, uh, tough way to the end of the regular season, you know, down here in Statesboro, and a, t and a tough, uh, tough game. Didn't uh, didn't play extremely well, as you as you can imagine. Uh, you know, I thought we got our butts kicked all the way around. To tell you the truth, I mean, uh, we uh, we didn't hold up well. Uh, offensively on the front line and in protection for the most part. We got behind them there a little bit and uh, they pressured us a little bit more than uh, they had in the past. And uh, and then defensively, we, we couldn't really contain their, their option game out of the edge. And, and that's what uh, that's what got us in the end. Special teams wise, we you know had a missed field goal. We had a blunder on a kickoff return right there. And just, you know, it just wasn't a good night uh, in all three phases of us. But, uh, you know, you learn from these things. You learn from the struggles. You learn from, from some of these mishaps. and. You know, we're playing with a gutsy group of guys, you know, some of those guys out there that, you know, they shouldn't even be out there playing and, and they will themselves to go out there and, and, and try to give us a win. So uh, so I'm very, very proud of them. Not very proud of the the uh, the outcome, of course, but uh, like I said, we'll learn from these struggles and we'll push forward to be better. Coach, um, after a tough game like this, what was the message to the team in the locker room? That we got our butts kicked. I mean, that's exactly what the message of the team is. Uh, you know, you you, you got to establish something, and we established nothing tonight. And that was the, the most disappointing thing. You know, uh, you, you have to address some issues that we had before the game and uh, and understand that, that that's not who we are. You know, there was, there was a couple mishaps before the game, some mouthing. Uh, I told them that's not who we are. You know, you get you let that stuff happen before a game, and you and you're defeated before you even go out. So, uh, I was very very disappointed in that, and and uh, and I really didn't even see how it went down. But uh, uh, it's not who we are. George uh, Southern was able to get Dan out of the pocket a lot, get him off his feet. Do you think that affected some of the third downs? Oh, I certainly do. I mean, that's what I meant by up front. I mean, we we didn't pr protect very well. We got in a throwing situation, and and uh, something they haven't done all year was uh, was pressure. And they brought more pressure than usual, and got Dan out of the pocket a little bit. And you know, when you got a you got a quarterback that, that, that doesn't have all the mobility right there, that's that's going to hurt you. And he, you know, he wow, what an effort that uh, for him to go out there and, and and try to do the things he did. I mean, it's still still unbelievable. So trouble to get seven there early, and then they kind of tighten things up. What was the Biggest change you noticed, like the big adjustment that they made. I, I couldn't hear you. I'm sorry. After you got the seven points, they made yeah. they kind of made some adjustments. What were some of the things that you thought they did differently? You know, I, I thought a little bit more pressure. You know, we we tried to tempo them early, and, and and when we got in the first down situation, we couldn't get in our tempo like we wanted to. If we didn't get you know a sizable gain on that first down, sometimes our throws were incomplete. I thought they did a nice job in their secondary containing, uh, but uh, yeah, that was that was ultimately it. Their pressure situations. Yeah, is that like, what, what are some things you guys want to key in on so that the result in the bowl game is a little bit sweeter than this one? I say that. Oh, I said, like, what, what are some things you guys want to key in on now going forward so that the result in the bowl game might be a little sweeter than this one? Well, I, mean, I think getting some guys healthy. You know, yeah. we, you know, we got so many guys that are that are out. You know, out for the season. I mean, uh, ultimately, until we get those guys back, we're, we're, we're going to have to play with what we got, and, and that's certainly fine. But uh, you know, just competing. You know. Eh, Listen, we, we've had we've had a really fine regular season, and, and we come down here and we didn't have a night uh, like we anticipated. So it, it, you don't have to go in there and say, "Oh, we got to change everything." Right. You know, it, just, it wasn't our night. Hats off to that that bunch over there that that played well and and, uh, and got the win. All right, Dan. Obviously, you guys got seven points early, and they kind of switched some things up. And what kind of looks were you getting out there? Uh, it was the same looks. We just didn't execute the way we should execute on offense. Uh, I thought a little adversity hit us. Uh, when that adversity hit us, we didn't know how to respond. Uh, you can put that on me. I gotta lead us better, and I gotta, uh, I gotta make sure that you know we, we respond to adversity. So you can put those. I can put that on my shoulders. Um, I gotta make sure that we keep continuing to strike, and uh, you know I just put all of it on me.